My name is Tammy and I am a traveler. My travel story has had a lot of twists and turns. Um, I graduated college with a ton of internships under my belt, um, but I never took the time in college to go explore or do any study abroad or anything like that. So after graduation, I settled into this great life and a great career. Um, I was in a relationship at the time. I was settling into my life in the Bay Area and I left one of the jobs that I was working at in a PR agency in San Francisco and I was about to start a new job and in between I took a month to go to Europe uh, and I had the, the most amazing time in Europe and then I came home and I immediately booked a two-week trip to Australia. Well, after those trips I returned home to my new job and I was miserable. Uh, the relationship that I had been in had fallen apart and I felt stuck. I felt stuck every day behind that desk. I had had a taste of what it was like to go see other places and to explore and to be truly happy again. And I was now sitting back behind a desk, stuck. So it was at that point that I really started looking at my life again and thinking, what really makes me happy? What, what would make me happy now? And the answer was traveling. So I decided to take some time away and travel full time for a while. And I am staring out the window of the place that I've lived for the last three, four years now. I moved in four years ago, January. Um, so I'm getting ready to say goodbye. I am leaving on this huge year long journey. Friday morning, I'm going to pick up a truck and bring it back here to load everything up. It's sad, it's bittersweet. This place is held some really good memories for me and also some really sad ones. So I'm looking forward to putting this behind me and looking forward to all of the amazing and incredible adventures that are waiting for me. Uh, so I left my life in the Bay Area behind and so I traveled. just arrived in Jackson Hole, Wyoming. Right now I am freezing and I am on the top of the tundra land here at Rocky Mountain National Park. Right now I'm hiking in Poas National Park in Costa Rica. I'm in Central Park right now and I am saying goodbye to New York City today. and having a great time but I came home to Phoenix to see my family for Christmas and I met a boy. This is JT by the way. I used to be a solo traveler and I'm not really solo traveling anymore. I've got a fun friend to join me. My brother decided that I needed to get out of the house and so he dragged me to a Christmas party and that is where I met JT. So our first date was actually on New Year's Eve and then we had one more date before I left on a solo trip. I was actually supposed to be gone for the next four months, but uh, that didn't, it didn't go that way. <laughs> I am super tired. I have spent all day, all day prepping. Um, I'm about to leave on my big trip tomorrow morning. I think the hardest part about tomorrow is going to be the goodbyes. I'm only really leaving my family for about four months and then I'll be back for a really short time here in the States. Um, but it's still, it's never ever easy to say goodbye. Uh, I ended up going to Costa Rica and Peru on that trip. Uh, we ended up talking every day that I was gone and I realized that this could be something big. I owed it to myself and to him to go home and see what it could potentially be. So I went home. So very, very long story short, that was two years ago. And now we live together in a house in Phoenix with his son Trey. And we have three dogs. We just bought a puppy together last year. 
and we have this beautiful little life that I never expected or anticipated and it's incredible. I found a job working as a marketing manager in Scottsdale and I love it. I, I really, really love this job and I've never ever said that about a job before. And everything just fell into place in the most incredible way. Suddenly I don't feel so trapped in my own life anymore. I'm writing the story now. So I went from a life of full-time travel to part-time travel, but believe me when I say that we really do make the most of our part-time travel and we make the most of our limited PTO. And the best thing about my travel life now is that I get to share it with someone I love. Uh, so this is day one of our cruise on the Allure of the Seas. So today we are in Epcot. So today we are in Right now we are on St. Kitts Island. So right now we are exploring a little bit of Arizona and we are heading into Arcasanti. This is day one of our cruise. We are sailing away on the harmony of the sea. This is the world's biggest cruise ship. Largest. Synonym. So now that I am working full time again, I am balancing that with my love of travel and exploring. Uh, I'm still a wanderer, I'm still a traveler, but I'm just doing it part-time now. But I've really missed sharing my adventures, so one of the things that I really wanted to do this year was restart my YouTube channel. Uh, I had an old YouTube channel, this one will be brand new, um, so over the next few weeks I'm actually going to be posting all of my old videos, one per week, um, and then after that it's all new content. Um, you're going to see a lot of the trips that we took this last year, um, and then you're also going to see where we're headed this coming year. I've got a ton of new stuff coming for you guys. What you guys are going to see on this channel are vlogs from all of our adventures. Um, you're going to see some lifestyle content, so I'll talk to you about my favorite travel gear and what I bring with me when I travel. And I'm going to be sharing with you guys how I afford to travel, how I really end up not paying much at all for travel because of all of the different hacks that I use, um, the things that I bring with me when I travel, and all of that great stuff. So if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up down below and hit that subscribe button. Um, you guys can also go ahead and follow me on Instagram as well. It's Tammy underscore travels. Um, and I'll be sharing a lot more live updates there this year so that you can actually see where we are at any given time. Until next time, I will see you guys all around the world. Bye.